Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these new Jose Ole. Uh, this is the burrito bowls. This one is the chicken salsa verde with white rice, vegetables, and flame broiled chicken breast and a robust tomatillo salsa. Looks pretty good. 17 grams of protein. Um, it is, well, wow, orange writing is hard to read. 10 ounces or 283 grams. Uh, these were at Meyer for $349. I'm sure they sell them other places, but that's where we got them at was Meyer. Uh, $349, not too awfully bad, I guess. So it is 300 calories for the package. So that's not bad at all. 300 calories for this entire container. It's a pretty good sized container. And there are no directions for anything else. So it's just microwave. So remove the tamper band from the package. Microwave on high uh, with lid on. For four and a half minutes, let stand for two minutes to complete the cooking. Remove lid, um, will be extremely hot. And stir well before eating and enjoy. So um, it does have this plastic protective band, so and it's perforated right here, you can see it. Well, maybe you can't see it, but it is perforated. I'm gonna pull that off. I'm just gonna take the lid off just so you, I can show you what it looks like, and then I'll put it back on. Yeah, some pretty decent sized pieces of chicken, lots of rice and stuff in there. So, uh, so anyway, I'm going to put this in the microwave, and I'll be back when it comes out. Okay, here it is out of the microwave, and uh, normally I would just eat it out right out of this package, but it's kind of a small container, so I'm going to take, i got a bowl here, and I'm just going to pour it in uh, to the bowl just so you can see what all is in here. Like I said, um, if you're eating it at work, you just you eat it right out of the container, but I want to wanna see what all is in here. It's a lot of rice. I pretty much got everything out. I'll scrape the rest of it out in a minute, but you can see... It's pretty much uh, rice, and you get some um, peppers, and you get a little bit of the green um, tomatillo, but that's that's it. You know, with it being a um, salsa verde, that's green sauce, you would think it'd be a lot more in here, but I really don't see a lot of green salsa in here, but lots of rice, anyway. Um, so rice may not last a long time for you. I don't know what the green thing is. I mean, that black thing is. Um, anyway, rice may not fill you up for a long time, but it'll fill you up for a little while. So I'm going to let this cool off for just a minute, uh, take out the rest of the rice out of that container, and stir it up really good, and I'll be back when it's cooled off just a minute. Okay, I gave it a little time to cool off. Not a lot, because rice gets cold pretty quick. So there's the you got chicken and peppers and the green salsa, and then uh, plenty of rice and corn. There's a piece of corn in there somewhere. So here we go. Chicken's cooked really well. It's good and tender. The uh, you get a really good uh, peppery spice, like um, like peppers, like a hot pepper. Uh, it's it's a little tingle in the back of your throat, but not super bad. Um, yeah. So if you don't like hot food, you may want to avoid this. If you just don't like hot food at all, if you can handle any kind of spice at all, you're fine with this. Um, Cause it goes away really quick. Like right now, it's already gone. Uh, but the flavors are mostly that. Um, that pepper flavor, that, that tomatillo sauce, uh, the, the green peppers flavor. I'm gonna try just a piece of chicken. Hmm. The chicken actually tastes um, like a grilled piece of chicken. It's really, it's really good. It doesn't, um, you know, it's not overly seasoned or spiced or anything like that. It's actually uh, got a good flavor to it. And it's good, um, the texture is really good. It's good and tender. Uh, let me try just the rice with some corn. The rice has got a good texture to it. Um, it's firm but not hard, so it's, it's got a really good texture. It's not mushy. Um, it actually comes apart pretty good. It's it's uh, not all clumped together. Sometimes you get this rice, it's really just all stuck together in a big clump. This one's not. Um, most of the seasoning, I think, is in the rice and the sauce that's used in the rice. The chicken gets some of that, but it's not as much as the, as the rice does. I think it's really good. Um, it's not, it's not like, oh, there's a huge onion, look at this. This onion did not get chopped up. <laughs> um, it's not like the best meal I've ever had by any means, but I do have to say, I really do like the flavors of it. I like the quality of everything. Um, there's plenty of rice here. Not a lot of chicken. There's, there's like four good sized pieces of chicken that I cut in half to make smaller pieces. Um, so I'd get more of it, so I'd go further. Um, plenty of corn. The, the pepper flavor is really is really good. So like I said, you really get more of that 
um, like a verde sauce. It's a green pepper sauce. Uh, it's what you taste. And the chicken's got a good, good um, roasted chicken flavor or grilled chicken flavor. Um, yeah, I like this. I'm gonna give it a four. It's definitely not, you know, it's not a five. It's not something I'd want to eat every day of my life, but um, but it's definitely one you should try out. It, it is a really good meal. So, uh, see, so yeah, I'm gonna stick with a four. I think I'll be filling for right now. I think I'll be hungry again later because it is mostly rice, and rice tends to doesn't stay with you for a long periods of time. So um, you get filled up quickly, but you kind of get hungry later. So I'll be ready for a three or three or four o'clock uh, snack probably. So yeah, I'm gonna give it a four. Hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.